Thank you so much. Asante sana Mheshimiwa for coming. Asante sana Betty Chalo for coming. Willis Raburu wa bebe tupigeni Willis Makofi tafadhali. Eh. Willis tu anakuanga mtu mzima lakini tabia zake ni za utoto. Sijaelewa. Sijaelewa ni kwa nini. Na pia tuko na ni unasikia? Tuko na Edi Butita. Wapi makofi ya Edi Butita? Eh? Hati sasa wewe uko na pesa mingi kuliko rais. Eh hey, Mungu ni mwema manzi. Chris Kiro unajua iko fia usifikirie anavaa kwa sababu ni heshima. Ni kipara anaficha. Chris abutoa kofia kidogo. Unaona kipara? Unaona hiyo kipara? Inakaa side mira. Unaweza pata jamaa ako na kipara kama hii. Lakini ako na pesa. Mademo anasifu hiyo kipara unasema oh my god. Akina penda kipara yake aipake mafuta avai sharp shooter anaka sponsor kiro kosa pesa same ladies will be oh my god sasa kama nywele zinashindwa kuishi na yeye mimi nda survive si tunakuangana situation kwa nyumba madhe na mzaya waongeleshani lakini wanatuongelesha sisi watoto wao shida ni mzaya utake advantage saa yenye ongei na madhe sasa ndio anataka kuni advice juu ya ndoa nataka usome Upite mutiani. Uende pale inje, you work hard, utavute pesa, upate kazi. Ukipata kazi, uoe mutu ambaye ako na akili. Usifanya zile mistakes nibanya tabadhali. Madena hea ako hapa. It is true, my son. Soma vita mutiani. Mm, na upate pesa. Usifanya musichana wa watu wafanya zile mistakes nibanya tabadhali. Nataka kabla tuende mbali sana nataka kukusalimia watu wa nyumbani kamera nyumbani ndio gani wale mnatutizama nyumbani welcome to chipukizi show this is the home of real fake news watu wa pwani watu wa wabuye watu wa bungoma and ma tala and ma kenoi and ma kangundo welcome to show make some noise for chipukizi show <laughs> So good to see you ma'am. Asante sana for coming. Pigeni Mr. Pasaris Makofi tafadhali. Nikikuona hapa manze na kumbuka vile siasa zimekuwa zimeshika hii town bwana. Eh siasa zimekuwa zimeshika butita. Eh? Bottom up. Rero rero ni rero. Acha <laughs> nikwambie. Hiyo wimbo ilikuwa inaimbwa. Najua mimi nimerudi mlolongo my friend. Alafu baba anatokea. Unajua baba hebu nicheze ngoma ya baba. By the way for the record. For the record. Bibi kama kuna mwanasiasa na heshima hii town ni baba. Baba, I am Zame try. Zame try. Thank you. Mzee unajua hata Kenyatta wangepatana angezumbua Kenyatta. Mzee alianza siku za moi. Huma moi. Akafinyana na moi wakaingiana na kibaki. Ewe. Kibaki naye alikuwa hata kiujinga. Kwanza unajua mimi nime meet baba, nimeperformia baba mara tatu. Ukifika protocol inakuita inakuambia vitu tatu. Usifanye jokes za stima kupotea. <laughs> unajua zikia sabi wa 207, stima zilikuwa zimewaka hivi. Let me take you back. Watu ni wakumbushi. Gen Z. Gen Z. Welcome to the class. 207 zilikuwa zimewaka hivi. Kivutu anasoma, Raila, Raila, Raila. Kibaki, Raila, 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 Kibaki. Zika zima. Halafu zika kuja. Kibaki, Kibaki, Kibaki. Zika zima tena. Alikuwa na Bible. Na hapa ya kwamba. Alafu baba, anakuanga relative wa kila tribe Kenya. Akienda turukana, anamambia wa turukana, oye, nini baba ni shemeji enu. 
mwaka wa 1962 oginga odinga alipatana na Tim Shemeji anaenda kwa waluya anamwambia waluya oye ababu na, na bongo wanga tu alipatana na odinga odinga 3 Shemeji alienda juzi kitu akasema kamba oye pia mimi ni mukamba nikiwa kijana nilikuwa nimekaukiwa kase I am happy that uh, this is the direction that God has shown me to take and we really are going to take it. And Butita, I want to appreciate you just mama kidogo master. Uh, this young guy we started together uh, he was younger than us. Truly shine kama yeye shine for many years. Na sasa tunaona ana shine na we are so proud of you bro. You are a great man. You are a legend. We don't take what you did for us for granted. Endelea hivyo bana. Na sipia yeye akuja tuchekeshe kidogo. All the way from Kariobangi, put your hands together for Eddie Butita. Kiangalia history ya music ya Kenya vile iko. I think uh, complain imekuwa forever. Hata Eric amekuwa na complain. Kenya music is not interna. Do you agree that? The reason why nili discover Diamond anaskizwa uko nje. Yes. Is because it's so easy to translate a song by Diamond. Mhm. Uh-huh. Kiswahili sandifu kinaweza badilishwa. Mhm. Uh-huh. Kiswahili ya Nairobi ni ngumu kubadili? Kubadilisha. Hebu nipatie ngoma ya Diamond. Eh, eh, Wacha tutumia kitambo. Wacha na hizi za chu chu chu. Tumia ya sura yake taratibu. Hold, hold. Translate that. Sura taratibu. Yes. She has no shy face. Humble. Humble. Mwenye macho ya aibu, shy eyes. Kumsahau na jari. Yaani to forget about her amtra. Sasa kuja inchi tukufu ya Kenya. Yes. Tuanze na legendary. <laughs> una jump, una una shida zina Aya to translate <laughs> You jump you fall down your problems they finish Una hauna You have you don't have Kuna wengine hao weka 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 Hapo kwa Francia Francia anasema aribu tu una Una shuta una hara unajipaka mafuta una parara Willis umesoma kizungu sana translate hiyo <laughs> You spoil the hair You spoil the air You dare you drive <laughs> You apply arimis You drive pen Lakini wacha nikwambie Truth of the matter is yeah. Tanzanians are different people na wa Kenya Ukisikiza wa Tanzania butita wakiimba eh. wale ni watu wa pole wa pole wa taratibu ndugu yangu sisi ni wa rough natural eh hey, manze vita Unona. tu unaona eh. ukisikiza hata ngoma zao hivi tatuache ku compare Kenyans na Tanzania we are different willis atuko tofauti ukisikia ngoma ya mtanzania ya break up na ukompe na ya mkenya ndio utaona hiyo tofauti <laughs> hata nikupea ngoma moja kama Salamu ulizonitumia zimenifikia niko salama hata usijali shatalishwa viponge zima hiyo sauti wewe <laughs> nimekusahau na kukumbuka na kujina kidogo za lau nasikia hiyo ni break up song by the way wameachana hawa Kenya Kenya <laughs> Unakataa kuwa demu yangu unaenda kwa mroki na kuroka unakufa unaringanga unaringa nini na sura mbaya atakuliko mbuzi unajua butita eh. ukiangalia eh. mimi na ushamba yangu yote eh. hata nikitafuta hawa mademu wa, wa, wa kutesa hawa kutesa hawa rembo hawa tutakuja hapo tunaingia hapo hapo tunaingia hapo lazima tuingie hapo tutaipiga yani nimejaribu ku nimejaribu kupenda hip hop eh. Mui mnaipenda hiyo life lakini usielewangwi aingii kwa system eh yeah, ni najaribu ni force nasikia lakini wanasema inakata sikia hii ngoma hmm? i've got a chopper in my car surely surely 
Surely, priority zako. A chopper in the? In the car. In the car. Okay, where you know what ni chopper, chopper. Oh, wana kuwanga na manager? It, it's a special type of gun called chopper. Oh. <laughs> Lack of education. Kuna mziki lazima usome tuki hangu de wene. I got a chopper in my car. I have a I'm a badass nigger. I've got a bullet in my head. <laughs> How are you a badass nigger, my friend? Kama kuna mtu alikupiga risasi na iko kwa kichwa yako. Huyo ndio badass nigger. Huyo mwenye alikupiga ndio badass. So your favorite nigga ni si hip hop. Reggae. Lakini nao wanaharibu. Shida ni Ukienda kwa hawa wababi hawa, yeah. uneza sikiza muziki uenjoy. Uh -huh. Ukilipa elfu tano, unaenda uu unasikia umeenjoy. Kwa sababu, wana kucheze yango ma 36 within one minute. Chik, 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 DJ ya naingiza. DJ ya naingiza, ingiza. DJ ya naingiza. Yeah. Reggae, ana kucheze yango ma moja. Night mzima. The whole night. DJ ukona, ukona, ukona busy signal, black. So, show me answer nine. Show me answer nine. MC ya mengia. Woza, 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 woza. Woza MC. And that before Chaz. No. And that before Chaz MC. Hip hop. Uwanga wana big up what we're live. Yes. Yeah. Big up Chris, I see you. Uh, big up, big up Grace, I see you. Maniga, maniga. Reggae wana big up was only dead. Big up the late Mato Manze waliku mada. <laughs> big up Manze. <laughs> Kala puzaza. Big up Steve Waki wa kamiti. Mutatoka. Akinye naona na choto na sodando ogo. Nisao. Unasikia butita? Sasa wanaingia. Shoi meanza. DJ, give me some reggae tunes. Pulo. Pulo. Special dedication to all the Rasta women in the building. Mr. DJ from the top. Pulo DJ, Pulo, I have a special message to Bob Marley. We respect you, Rasta. Mr. DJ, from the top. Pulo, Pulo, a message to everybody who is a demo bleacher. If you bleach your face, I have a message for you. Black Lives Matter. Mr. DJ, from the top. But if you are a defender, you are a defender. But you are a defender. You know, you know, if you are a bad dancer, you are a bad dancer. And a reggae. You know, music is in Guinea. The pressure is so high. Hey! Leo kuna style siju ya kufanya nini. Siju ya ni. Kuna vitu TikTok watu wanafanyanga. Yani, iyo club ya hip hop. Yes. Ya ama piano. Bro, do you know any ama piano dance style? Mina juu atuza katibu imbro. Yama piano kwanza udansingi ukiangali. Atu lazima uge uke. Ni yama dempe ke. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, mweshmiwa. Kagombe wagatundu. Ambe tiunga na sisupike ni makofi. Mweshmiwa. Karibu sana. Mweshmiwa, mweshmiwa. Governor. Huyu diwa mekalia hile kitu huru kenyata alikuwa mekalia. Mweshmiwa ni chai yangu. Huyu ni chai yangu mweshmiwa. Eh, eh, eh. Na fiyo isimiwa tena ni maboy flani Walikuwa tu mahasla wakaingia Yo na ni ukweli Neza tres High cloud ineza nionye shako gatundu Kama huu jiji Kama huu jiji ya mengi hapa tu Umo isimiwa alikuwa tu boys Yani alikuwa tu jamatu Ujewa na jamatu Alafu Kizungu ni nime kuja kurealize kusoma ni poa. Yeah. Unajua ukikuwa umesoma siku moja utavaa suti. Ehe. Yeah. Alafu ingie mali watu ma, watu wengine wasema hey excuse me yes my name is Kagombe and um, I'm a businessman. Uliza Salasia. Ndio. Ndio kitu wewe. Unajua the gods must be crazy. <laughs> Ushaya wachi yo movie. Salasia. Lakini ni wewe. Umse ucheka throughout. Hata kwa kwa matanga. Tuko hama kwa matanga. Tumepoteza hama mtu ya mekufa. Na sasa tumeuzinika zana. Sasa ningevena kukuambia wili ya meruko. Maremu elikoni tumziri zana. Sikia budina. 
Wacha nikuulize ya kuna moja ni na nyinyi watu wa SPM zi watu wazuri. Hii SPM buzz hii imeletwa itumalize Willis. Eh Mheshimiwa Salasia, hebu hebu niambie ni nini kinafanyika hapa KICC? Hii ni sasa mambo tuko hapa ni ya climate change. Jizi nikiwa Mombasa nilikuwa nasikia baridi. Nikauliza hii baridi ni Wakaniambia ni mambo ya global warming. Alafu alitibamba the next day rojua kwa hapo TikTok anasema kama unajua kizungu si uko mbunge. Akia sasa. Mheshimiwa karibu sana. Tupigeni mheshimiwa makofi tafadhali. I really appreciate what you're doing now. This is so great. It's in 20 I think it was in 2016 when Chipukizi show started at somewhere in uh, Siokimau. Siokimau. Yes. Yeah, as a YouTube show, then it grew to a TV show somewhere in Lovington. The reason why is to come for that show every week and we used to create content uh, right for the show was because I felt happy for the first time we had a show that an artist is controlling like let's say everything how the content that goes on stage your dream pia bro may achieve na tuko so proud of you na tunaendelea bro goal li uko uko na meka ngapi sasa hii ni 33 umekaa sana hapo mwingi hapo ju 33 haje mwingi hapo bro tulikuwa naye mwaka same hapana bro okay sasa mi goal yangu ni mimi niko mimi niko 30 ya ukweli mmm kwa ni yangu si ya ukweli So mimi nataka mimi na wewe tu tuna make promise to the audience yes. the next five years nitakuwa 35 wewe utakuwa 39 seven 5 yes. plus 3 38 tukwa 233 but eh uh-huh. so mimi nataka wewe create wase 20 okay powerful brands okay we are going create 20 good challenge sio good challenge come to the audience good challenge ah say wame grow jinsi tulipata opportunity yes. na pia wako na shows zao si ndio hivyo Thank you sir. Yeah. Asante sana. Edi Butita ladies and gentlemen. Yo, yo. Ladies and gentlemen all the way from Nairobi Kenya. Put your hands together for my co-host for tonight. Bena Wama Lines Wewe. Usikuje hapa na hizo bangi zako hapa pia wewe. Kuja hapa na heshima bana. Hapa kuna wadosi hapa. Zajibu umezao sindo tulikunga inde pale uta ango. Tukaku andi tukakundia nota. Nika kuna zani sana ule zozo plan zo mepongete. Umepongete? Ati nyota yangu ilitoka wapi? Ah ah, acha tujiende ndip. Okay? Tujiende ndip. Na ukitaka tuende hapo tutaenda. Tuone ni wa tambaki. Una ni plopo kwae? No mama. Kama zima ina ndumu, ndumu tuwe. Yenda na irundi. Mimi hata na kuheshimu sana hasa. Eh, Andi ni kwa mndongo ipi? Unilize back dog ye. Unaona ile kitu nilikuwa nakwambia wakamba wakikasirika, huyu amejam sasa. Ani. Zinja. Eh, nimejam. Yona yona zita picha. Okay? Na ibondo mmesoya mbadhi kwa public at yo, nda picha nimejam. Nizi pichi pili nzoge. Blindo mopex blazon. Okay, like po, like police dance. Njoo kuna bilembe dijalo ameni. Huyu <laughs> Wewe unawezana na beti chalo hata tukakupea. Is you see me kwa sana? Is you near kwa sana? Ziwacha ni njimonge ni lucha kama onja niona ka. Njua unanjua ina kwa step 1 step 2 so you one is a kilo je. Sasa zinile za kupungia kwa kenje. Unaona bila mlikuwa mna and kana sikwa na ndongi. 
So mukianza mulikuwa mnakimbisa zungula. So zungu ndongi kizika zungula sasa inangeuka. So mnakimbisa ndongi iyajilia zungura. Nizatika. So nalikimbisa ndongi iyajili. <coughs> Sinanjua ndio uko hapo. Tia tia undai. <coughs> So, Charlo, I don't see Ongana, I own the one that's a port of Goga. Me and this in the Alot, Sanguni, Betty, Betty is used, Sanguni, Betty is used. When boss, Ling, Ling, Ambu Pika, Pika, eh, Sasanata Gombonga, Pila Luguna Bonga, eh. Suli kwa pa ipi unatua makucha uchui Hata tuwa na kondoni wichi na chui ni wichi that Hata ni melime in silent Your Excellency Your Excellency umeanza kutembea na watu wa bangi Eh, habana Na unajua mimi Mimi ni mutu ya kupigana na hizi vitu Bijana kama hawa Ah, ah, usikani mbio mse Hapa ipi Eh, this time Si mtu mtu jipo Andi, andi we mugumbu neza o nonge. You need to understand. Right now, I'm not the MP of Madera. I'm the deputy president. Thank you very much. Hey, Simu bana. Uni moesimi wa una onge onge apa wacha tuonge na wadosi bana. Yes. Your Excellency. Yes. Karibu sana bana. Asante sana. Yes. I'm very happy. Muga na muga ni. Muga sawa sawa. Munataka tukitoka hapa tupange bashi kidogo. Na muna hii, na muna hile. Na juu na chini. Ni chaacha one million shirins Tanzanian. Mwishmiwa, ukiachana na watu wa bangi. Ni kuulize climate summit imeisha. Yes, and you know, it was kind of dramatic. Because on the second day, I was supposed to welcome the heads of state. Unfortunately, a normal citizen of this republic. Yes. Just came, and uh, I was to welcome him. And uh, unfortunately, I did not know that he is a head of state. And because he's not a head of state of any state, I welcomed him as a head of state of emergency. <laughs> And I greeted him, I reminded him, he's just a normal citizen, just like Fred Matiangi, just like Karaja Kevisho, just like George Genoti. Now, Mwishmiwa, tuliona Kalonzo Musioka alikuja State House. Yes. Kwa nini wale wabunge waki expelliwa tujaona Mwishmiwa kiweza... Iyo, ndiyo zuari mimi ni makuwa ni kiurisa. Ni makuwa ni kiurisa hivo, deo, ni kaurisa. Kalonzo walikuwa pade, akakula chakula ya State House. Yes, na kabeba ingine, na yeye, haja kuwa expelled pare kutoka kwa azimio, lakini vijana wengine, wale akina jalango, na wengine, wamekua expelled. Lakini ya ina shida, we have no problem with that, we are honest people, we just tell them welcome. Solidarity forever, solidarity, Ricky Chuko hapa. Semaja mse. Ni ojeshe maani pa kukau taata kusema hapa ni pa deputy president mara ni pa marais mara pa nini. Nikae wapi. Asa wewe mse. Umekua kwa zarekari kutoka wakati ya mkononi. Umepapana na hiyo zarekari. Thank you. Nikae hapa. Ya unaweza katu. Thank you very much. Unajua sasa wewe umeonga sisi zarekari. Na sisi ni watu ya kuzamehea watu. Sisi tumba kuzamehea. Hata kama ulisema tukate. Lakini ya liongea vibaya sana huyu. Nini nilisema vibaya? Yes. Nini nilisema vibaya? Uliko unasema tukate mitigani. Ye. Ni mitigani ulisema tukate. Mimi nilisema miti ikatwe. Nigani hiyo. Kuna hile kitu munasemanga ati mimi nilisema. At Ruto can never be the president. Ye. The media edited. Nilisema what I meant was. Ruto can never be the president after 2032. Iyo after 2032, they edited it out, shenzi sana. Atuoli, tungependa kujua suwali moja tu. Nandiyo tumekuita hapa leo. Unaritaya lini? Urisa, yes, yo suwari. Jibu. Is there anybody worth taking my office? That is the question I can ask you. Urejua kuna watu wengi vijana ambao wanaweza kufanya yo kazi wa chukue. Jibu, kisi, listen. I have a wife. I still need to take her to salon. 
you to take wise. our night where when I talk Wednesday, G ladies, I have a family, I have a wife to support. Sasa di kiacha kazi. How will I support her? Waheshimiwa sisi yes. tunashukuru sana nyinyi kupitia hapa kuwa nasi tuwapigeni hawa wadosi wetu makofi tafadhali Tukiondokea mheshimiwa Atoli ni advice gani ungependa kuambia vijana na wa Kenya in general What I want to tell vijana ambao nadisikiza hapa If you treat your woman well God gives you other women Okay <laughs> And when, when you are wealthy and you have money, there is no need of having one wife. How in Guinea what I end up? Thanks, guys, for watching. Chipu kisi so will be will be right back after the break. Light is in Mwangaza. Right. Me too. So call you after break. Oh, light, light, yeah. E. Oh, will be light. Back. Will be light back after the. Blake, after the Blake. Thank you for watching the Mukimi show. We'll be right back after the break. After the break. And we are back. We are back. We are back. We are back. And now, ladies and gentlemen, I want to introduce a friend of mine. This guy is one of the funniest people I know. He's one of the most successful comedians uh, that I've seen in this our country. Ladies and gentlemen, put your hands together for my good friend, Jemo Ulemse. Jemo! Haribu sana, busi. Munajua huyu, mwesh. Sisi tuko huko. Watu wanaitisha kura. Manifesto zinasomwa. Zinalaunchiwa. Alafu mutaingunyi anakuja kutwita anasema ati hii ile presidential launch ule mtu wako ya banki. Kuna wakati tulikuwa tu launch manifesto yes. on a Saturday. Then uh, uh, on Monday we received a call from a competitor mm. wakasema mnataka kufanya Saturday tunaweza fanya Thursday mm -hmm. okay mm -hmm. kaenda kwa ofisi ya Mutai Ngunyi yes. tukakaa chini tukakula mbaki hapo kidogo hii ni true story yes yes okay you can uh, you can tweet again <laughs> <laughs> sawa so, tukakaa tukasema akasema tuna akasema wao intention yao ni kuharibu yenu Okay that was their intention. Na sisi intention yetu ilikuwa ni manifesto launch. Yes. Wewe kama bazu mwenye yako kwa industry. Hii ganji naona wasanii wanasikia kama Butita ana earn more than the president. Sijui njugusha na earn more than Biden. Kuna do kipindi iko wapi? Juu sasa pia mimi niko na Instagram dosi. Hey. Iko online man. Eh. Hey. Yaani pesa iko wapi bro? Content creation ni kama real estate. Okay? Mm. Mashamba hazitaisha na zita ikosa kuuzwa manyumba zitajengwa na naweza kuwa na shamba kidogo lakini ni jem, ni jenge kwenda hivi 100 floors okay mm. na mtu kuna mtu mwingine atakuwa na shamba kubwa ajenge kitu fulani there is money in content creation e, tunashukuru system ya Talanta Hela where we have people in government who understands mm. what that Talanta ilikuwa pande hii Mm. Hela ilikuwa pande hii mm. sasa ziweke pamoja mambo ifanyike. Mm. What we are asking is that initiative eh, na naweza sema hivi isikuwe a PR exercise ya kufurahisha wasani mm. and we understand there are so many things that are going to happen mm. let it be something that will work because if it works that is a good chance for me to talk to waziri kindly waziri hapa chipukizi show tuko tayari kuchukua talanta hela vile jemo anasema isikuwe kipindi to publicize, to partie, zile talent utapata platforms yeze kuomoka. Endelea mdosi. Yes, yes, so it is there. Yes. There is a lot of money. We can make money. The corporate companies can invest a lot of money. Wako na pesa. Ni njia bado ilikuwe na jijenga. Yes. And then, there is no competition. Sababu, bena wa malines agivanya kitu, 
Siwezi kuongea kama yeye siwezi fanya hizo vitu wanasema. Mm. Atuoli alikuwa hapa, Rigiji alikuwa hapa, kina Wawaya, akina Butita, wewe mwenyewe. What you are doing? Not so many people can do that. So that's why I'm saying it's a real estate. Kuna mtu wako na ikatano Karen, kuna mtu wako na ikatano Gedhorai. Kuna mtu wako na ikatano na Manga, kuna mtu wako na ikatano Kakamega. Mm. It's all what you do with it is what matters. Depression inatoka wapi? Eh? Tunaona wasanii tuna wasanii wana dedi unasikia huyu ni depression nimemchapa. What's the problem? Eh, shida kubwa ni unajua watu kama wanajua hakuna kitu noma kama kujulikana na una pesa. Mm. Hiyo ndiyo lazima mtu ajue utadila aje na hiyo kitu. Mm. So unapata watu wengi wanakujua, wanakusifu, mm. wanakuita, wanafanya nini, wanafanya nini. Mm. Then you don't have uh, the money to support what you think. Then it gets to your head. Mm. Then you start thinking you should live a certain kind of a lifestyle. Mm. Ile kulingana na venye jina yako imevuma. Mm. So ukiingia kwa hiyo mtego mm. kama hujajipanga kidogo kidogo lazima utaingia kwa depression. Yes. Watoto wanaanza kuwa wote ni wako. Yes. Na sasa kama una pesa watoto ni warembo. Mimi sijui ni kusema tu nasema. Mm. Eh, kama we unawitanga hivyo that's a good thing. Mm. Lakini unapata if you want to live beyond your means because of your brand because people are loving your content and then you forget yourself lazima utaingia kwa hiyo mtego. Mm. Eh, utakuwa akili kidogo inapiga sana ukijaribu lakini ukijua hii ni kazi kama ile ingine twende tusonge tusonge pesa ikijaa sasa unaweza anza kufanya hizo madoido unataka i think niki add value hapo nafikiri pia mimi husema kwamba usanii ni job tu kama umakanga usanii ni job tu kama walimu si lazima just cause when kuna walimu wanakuanga popular na bado wanalipwa tu kama walimu wa kawaida so hata ukikuwa famous na usote haimaanishi uwezi enda ukayakario banki unaweza kuwa tu famous na usote tu E, unaweza kuwa makanga na ukuwe msanii unaweza kuwa polisi na ukuwe msanii si lazima just cause watu wengi wanakujua utake kuishi vile hao watu wengi wanakujua wanataka uishi kikikurambe waacha kikurambe kama uli crack joke ndio ukaingia kwa hiyo fame rudi tena uandike joke tena ikurudishe hapo ndio kupatia ganje eh na pia wase wajue kusota ni normal pigeni sadia makofi tafadhali ijipu <laughs> Iunga ni achia man. Kandi ida ni kwa nime na mbeti chalo acha tu mani lisa ni ni choices. So watu kama hawa kikuliza what do you do for a living? Unawambi unafanya ngani ni for a living? Content creation. Yes. And uh, I also work in corporate. Okay. So kibe alikuwa na sema ati butita na kununuanga unakuwa demi yake for a weekend. Iyo ni fact ama ni ni kipindi. Juu kama ni hivyo pia mimi naweza kukomboa kidogo kuna mahali naenda kesho <laughs> niende ni test unajua kama content creator labda mm. naweza kuomboa pia butita kwa kwa, kwa video yangu oh si tunafikiria wewe butita ndio amekukomboa kumbe wewe ndio umemkomboa butita yako wapi kumbe ni hara model for hire bro <laughs> kwa nini ni wewe tu naona uki producea content na masimba huko kwa nini wale wasichana wetu wenye wako tiktok wale sio mbua wako huko kuna wengine hapa huyu MD wa Radiko na Mwananga TikTok watu hapa kwa nini hawatesi vile unatesa what is the secret and like for example hapo mlikuwa wapi na hizo simba south africa south africa A- south africa hapa tu down <laughs> so uko menda south africa ku content create yes but that's a very expensive trip so e content creation inarudisha do bado uh, so ni kama investment una invest do kubuki of flight hoteli mm. una invest time energy mm. kupaka makeup ku, ku drive hours kwa location ku shoot all day ku edit mm. una invest and then eventually ukipata brand deals inajilipa but instead of ku, ku spend do mm. una invest more on more ideas unaenda like same Europe. So umeenda wapi? Umeenda wapi? Hebu niahesabie. Uh, Italy, Portugal. Portugal, Spain. Spain. Hizo tu. Wewe umeenda wapi na content creation? Nimetlapel. Kutlapel. This is and in the pathes nimetlapel at least nimepi nimeingia <laughs> Indilia kwa high class. So mimi nimetlapel unapata nime na njua Loisa 
Get the pop pipe in the pop What is the difference between the Kenyan TikTok and the TikTok in China? Very, very different. What's the difference? First of all, Kenyan TikTok, I feel like, Atuna content. Mm -hmm. We don't explore more ideas. We have so many resources in Kenya that we don't use. Mm -hmm. I feel like as TikTokers, we are lazy. Mm -hmm. We don't think outside the box. Mm -hmm. Like, badala kushut kwa bedroom, unezenda Kibera, unezenda Nairobi National Park, unezenda Kariobangi, unezenda uko kwa nyamachoma, like very different things unezenda create content out for. Unezenda tea farm, especially places that highlight Kenya. Unelewa? Unezenda Masai Mara. So like, I feel like Kenya tuko lazy, hatutaki ku explore like and there are three resources in your silas mulipie. Kama kwenda kibera silas mulipe. Kama kwenda gikomba ku shoot content silas mulipe. But nakini no patasasa wengini kama nyini mutu ni mbabi aezi yenda gikomba. Abat nangi yata mat. Sasa na jani ni yondo content. Osa yenyu pandangi matu wende gikomba. Aa, yondo content. The mbabi kwa gikomba. Yoni content. I'm waiting. Nangonja yoni kuwana gikomba. <laughs> I'm waiting in that. And I will remember peeping the lead. Nikonayo ntafanya part two kitaka. Eh, part two. No, nini kulunde. Stand up for what? To follow us na nini nini. So, sayi, sirikali mekua kisema TikTok izimwe, TikTok ifumwe, TikTok ikue monetize. Is it something that we mwenye unge support, Sadia? Obviously, say they support TikTok ifumwe, even when you see to survive Kenya. Yeah. Very good. How much money zile mingi umetanganeza na TikTok na usiogope ni ngapi? Over how long? Uh, in a year? Um, in a month? In a month, love the 300. 300? TikTok? MD badilisha TikTok. Wait! Mbandu niyo TikTok ya Kenya mani. Nile ya Kenya sasa. Ni which? Wait, ni pesa ngapi mingi umetengeneza TikTok wewe? Wait, TikTok ina make ndu? 300k. Au, tap tap. Hithi ya tap tap, guys. Thank you for the lotion. Thank you for the lion. Ama ni wish. Muna si make out. So, kuna wale wa live. Okay, wait. Apart from bland endorsement to hand patch up a good. Iyo ya no? Iyo ya tap tap. Iyo. Iyo pia ina make do mob, unaza make up to one million a month. Alapsa chipu, the funny thing, umdu ananza kutap tap, 7.30 p.m. Bando po 30 a.m. Tap tap guys, guys, guys. Anando sa kiwa life, ipo ndo mna make do. Iyo siku amisha ingiza 100k, iyo tu, 4 hours. Jitu mekase. So mini ate kundos. Utap tap. Tap tap tu. Angalie le kamera nyumbani my dear, wambie wale wasichana wako Tala, wako Webuye, wako Mombasa, awana access yenye uko nayo. Awajaenda Europe, hata kwa hakuna mtu ashaenda Europe. Lakini wakisikia story yako mwanzo anataka kuingia TikTok na inakaa kipindi. What would you tell them? I would tell you one thing, invest if it's time, energy, money, whatever you have in front of you, start from there. Hata mimi nilianza na iPhone 6, siko na tripod, nilikuwa nika kwa diri. Wait, wait. Wait! Iyo ni pomezo ni painful. Juzi nilisikia wengine wakisema, oh, I was so poor, I used to sleep in my car. So, you are baby, ano niyambiati, I started small, I started with iPhone 6. So, you started with iPhone 6, uh-huh. Which one do you have now? 14. Unatumia gani wewe? Mizi ni kutupa na tululiza. Katululu. Okay, very good. Now, there's a friend of mine, Zwinda Mwangalesha kwa ile kamera, na ito Andrew Kibe. Ningependa kuambia Andrew Kibe, tafadhali, just know ni memuhaya. From today on, she is my girlfriend for hire. Actually, the name is Afodo, yeah. Awe, pia we, kuenda. Awe, kuko uko right. Aha, no, no. Kito unakuanga right. Zaj, umenjam. We are not simping for no one. We are going to follow your guidance. No, no. 
We are not going to accept you to give me whips. Mm, nini? Lakini pigeni umrembo makofi tafadhali. Thank you so much for coming. And we are back. 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 Before ni mkaribishe mheshimiwa aniongeleshe. Wacha ni kuje hapa chini ni, ni muongeleshe mheshimiwa wangu women rep. Check. Eh, mdosi mimi nataka utuambie tu jambo moja lakini nataka nikushukuru sana. Hapa live on camera for coming, sitting through hii ujinga tunafanya hapa. We don't take it for granted. What is that one word you want to tell uh, young people? First I'd like to say that uh, congratulations on your show. Thank you for the invite. I don't take it for granted. Um, I actually was in Mombasa for a function and I, for committee meetings, but I came because I wanted to support what you're doing. All right? I know... Post-COVID, it's been very, very hard for uh, artists, especially comedians, to get back into that space. And I feel that it's an area where you can make good money and you also can get people out of depression. Mm. You know, mental health is real. Laughter is one of the cures. You know, where you just can let go, forget for a few, a few even if it's an hour, yeah. just forget your problem and then realize life isn't that serious after all. So the youth can also come up with ideas and then we come up with the money to fund them. Yes. But I think never give up hope, put God first in everything, and know that this is the only country we have. So let's just do the best to grow our economy. Thank you. Thank you so much. Let's appreciate Mom. Thank you so much for coming. We celebrate. Now, ladies and gentlemen, allow me to introduce my good friend, uh, the MP for Gatundu, Mwishmua Uru. Sorry, uh, Mwishmua Kagombe. Wapi makofi ya Kagombe tafadhali? Tutuli hapa, eh? Very good. Karibu bosi. Karibu sana. Mpige ni mwishmua makofi, manzi. Yani mwishmua. Siamini wewe ni mweshi. Wacha tuwanzia hapo kwanza. Uliamuka haji mdosi. Ukajipata wewe ni mbunge. Tena wewe siyo mbunge tu. Wewe ni mbunge wa former president. Hii safari mianzafa. Mina kumbukanga nikiwa seko. Liliana nika chiki. Kuna vile mamode walikuwa. Wezi nipatia job za mao. Za piri, urifu, nini. Yes. Ivo, unacho huko, ivo, nyuma. So mimi nikaona hapa hivi lazima nijiundie ka position. Mm. Uko chuo sasa Seko. Eh, nikaanza drama club. Nikaanza yes. debating club. Huyu jemo mwenye ulikuwa naye hapa. Yes. Tulikuwa daro moja. Mmesoma na jemo ule mzee? By the way nilikuwa index 1. Jamaa mwingine mwenye alikuwa napigana na mimi huko Gatundu South alikuwa index 2 na jemo alikuwa index 3. Na tulikuwa tunaka hivyo tumefuatana kwa daro. So nikamwambia hapa wacha tuanze kipindi. Yes. Tukaanza uh, 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 debating club. Yes. So unajua Jumini nimeanza sasa mimi no chairman. Yes. Sasa kwanza nikaanza ku creative opposition. Mdosi uhuru hakuna mahali ilifika juu uko una computer genesis candidate. Hakuna mahali ilifika akakuongelesha akakwambia hiyo vile unakuja kuja pole pole bwana. Ama wachana na hiki kitu ni mpe mtu wangu. Ilifika na iko kuwa rais. Do, it is not easy at any time kuenda against the sitting president. Yes. Na kwanza kitu mekuambia kwa mdomo yake, alafu ulenga. Na ojua, hii ni patapotea wakati ngine ingeenda any other way. Mm. Do you think that our generation and even the current parliament, do you feel like now that we ni kijanana uko hapo ndani, ukiangalia hours there wa kuintimidate na unaona ni kama tutaachivio. Kuna kukabila bado kakondani, but we ukiangalia unaona by the time tumaliza five years. Tutakuwa tukona a parliament that is issue based. I think we are uh, by and large, yes, we are we are living that politics of uh, tribalism, and you know we we like creating cocoons that do not that do not exist. Because you know, when you when you have exceeded or uh, superseded the the cocoon of tribalism, ukieno mm. kondani unapata clanism, ukitoka clanism unapata families, ukitoka families unaskia 
sisi ni wanawake nyinyi ni wanaume ukitoka hapo mm. unasikia sisi ni you know ichama, we, we, like, ichama. we like sasa ina back ina back ichama when you realize that these are just cocoons that we create but our issues are the same mm. we will get out of it and i think by and large maybe because of the circumstances that we find ourselves in we are getting out of it gradually juzi niliona video social media ukiwa mkali sana ukitaka kupigana na askari na nikafanya mchunguzo na nakujua sija kuona kama umekasirika hivyo miaka mingi nikafanya investigation ka realize iko maneno kiambu i think what is happening in kiambu ni kwamba kuna kuna watu ambao wanapimana nguvu mm. and i think it's just a matter of uh, misunderstanding it, it's a small issue mm. ni kitu ndogo tu but if you don't you know that swahili is saying kwamba usipoziba ufa utajenga, utajenga ukuta, ukuta. Mm. It, it's just it i would uh, i would say that is it history ndogo ndogo ya watu kusema mimi no mdosi you know those things mm. if you there is nothing uh, of substance mm. it's just uh, relational, relational issues mdosi ajenge ukuta azibe ufa saizi asizibe ukuta asijenge ukuta. ukuta and and by the way at all times and i would urge all leaders at all times when you are two leaders uh, trying to checkmate each other trying to fight trying to show might there is monenchi at the middle mm. in the middle of all this anataka services who need services anataka bursaries so for me even in yote kiburi nini it's not necessary we are among few mps wale ni maona wakitaka ku champion sana mambo ya mavijana juzi ni limit na wasee wa online media wakaniambia mpaka uko na plan uko nayo uko na mpaka mswada unataka kupeleka mwingine na ukituambia juu hiyo mswada ni nini inakufanya sana utake kutufaitia sisi wasee wa content creation na kwa nini ni nini unaona kwa government sahi ama kwa parliament ama kwa system ya Kenya yenye unaona wasea wa understand when it comes to this space of content creation the only employment that has been left because of the versatility of our people and the youth especially is media creation mm. you have seen that we have seen you have seen that you've been making good steps in it Kapisa? and we have normalized mediocrity people just making statements mm tutatengeneza kazi mm. so tutatengeneza kazi tutawapa alafu serikali inakwambia nyinyi mtengeneza kazi mjipange hapo alafu serikali yenyewe by law by a statute by an act of parliament says that advertisement ya serikali iende kwa gazeti with two kwa, kwa watu wawili ati either two of the four only and everybody else who is a media content creator ambao ni watu wana reach people na tunajua measurable things that we know mm. umeuliza hapa jemo mm. kwamba video zake ameonwa na watu wangapi in the last akasema 2 billion mm. yani kwa sheria huo ni mse aezi pe ana information ya gava <laughs> yani mkwanja yenye natoka hapa hivi 350 billion ina na kuwase wanne na tunaweka kwa sheria that's why i came with a law and i said we must amend article 96 of the public procurement and disposal act yes yenye nasema ati kwamba gava kita communicate kitu lazima iende kwa wasi wawili wenye wako na mapepa kubwa my 6 year old child daughter is always on on on, on tiktok kabisa but how i wish that kcd kenya institute of curriculum development inaweza chukua hawa si ude malikuwa hapa anaitwa sadia amchukue wamwambie hii kitabu mimi tulikuwa tunasoma read with us hiyo yenye sasa read with us ya saa hii hiyo ya, ya cbc wafanye content ikwe ikwe kwa curriculum ikwe kwa, ikwe kwa twitter ikwe kwa kwa hiyo tiktok yenye mnasema put educational content in it hawa si watu watakuwa job kwa hivyo ni lazima tuwe na culture tolerance na kuheshimiana na wenye wako na wenye wanasikia a bit uncomfortable because we have come and we are we are mudding the water get used to it mm. zoea Mm. Zoe hiyo maneno ana Zoe hiyo sauti hii imeenda hii yeah, Zoe hiyo we tutawasumbua until tunyoke and until we start dealing with these young people of us eh yeah. kwa sababu sisi ndio wengi we are the majority na kuna space tunataka katika meza and we must fight for that space we must fight for the economic space we Agree. must fight for the political space Agree. we must fight for this space and by the way we have no option we have no choice Asante sana tumpigeni mheshimiwa makofi tafadhali Thank you so much for coming Dosi. Ukiondokea Kiremba umeingia hiyo chama ama ni kipindi? By the way. That's a whole topic. 
you know, going to parliament. No, no, listen to this. You know, tuna kasumba za kikoloni. Ati bunge ya Kenya 2023 ukiingia bila tai mm. na suti inakuwa noma. Do you know how many do you know how much money we spent last year on apparel? Is it suti na hizo ngozi za tumevaa? We imported 140 billion worth of clothes. Na si mtumba mtumba ilikuwa about uh, 50 50 billion collectively nguo zenye tulitoa nje tulitoa kwa hii economy yetu tukatuma in other economies tuka create jobs worth 200 billion in other economies unajua ni kwa nini mm. unachekika unda suit umevaa mm. ni kwa sababu kuna msee fulani alianza kuvaa kaunda suit juzi kabisa because leaders are uh, are creators of fashion mm. they are trend setters so mwesh umeingia ama hujaingia hapa kwa kiremba nimepata hiyo story yote kanisa kirudi kwa kiremba huko kwa kanisa ama huko mimi ni napenda Mungu na tuanze hapa nikupea tu mic hapa utuchape kama ngaru ya junior tukafa sahihi <laughs> ladies and gentlemen let's appreciate mheshimiwa kagombe thank you so much bro for coming you're such an inspiration to us continue fighting for us na hapo kwa content creation sisi tuko nawe hapo sisi tuta support vile unataka na sisi tunataka tuomoke pia sisi kabisa asante sana asante makofi wa ladies and gentlemen one more time Ladies and gentlemen, I want to bring on stage. These guys came up with a language, with a culture. Mabibi na mabwana, nataka tuwakaribishe Epic. Shule nimesoma, Mungu nimeomba, kazi nimesaka, wengi nimeomba. It's been an amazing experience. Thank you so much for everybody who watched us. Watu wa Malaba, watu wa Mombasa, watu wa Kisumu, watu wa Kambani. Tuonane next week, same place, same time. This is Tibukizi Show, home of real fake news. Bila mapepas, ni kunoma.